Hello everyone, it's Hayley here. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to discuss exactly how you can never get scammed in Adopt Me. Scammers, we've all heard of them, they're out to get your pets and they're pretty much everywhere. I was scammed enough when I was new and have seen pretty much all the scams out there. I think I'm at the point where I don't think I can get scammed and I'm going to teach you exactly what I've learned in order to never get scammed. I think you've probably heard this a million times but you seriously cannot trust anyone in Adopt Me. Not everyone has the best intentions and there are a lot of people who will leave their miles behind in order to get your pet. Whether it's your online best friend, your friend from real life, someone just that it just appears to be super nice, you should never trust them. Some people purposefully gain your trust with the motive of scamming you and it's really sad but it's just true. Never do things where you have to trust anyone or hope that they don't scam you. Your gut instinct is probably right. Try not to ignore the signs because most of the time they are probably trying to scam you. This leads me to my next point. You need to shorten your friends list. Go through all your friends and ask yourself if I gave them a frost dragon, would they give it back? This question helps you to decide if your friends are actually trustworthy and if you doubt for a second that they wouldn't give it back, it's time to unfriend them. I mean, after all, if someone would do such a horrible thing, they probably aren't a good friend to start with. Although I would never test this, I'm certain that my friends on Roblox would hold up to this. If you have a friend who admits to scamming, you've seen them scam or has scammed you before, it's also time to unfriend them. Having limited and trusted friends can definitely prevent you from being scammed. Learning about scams is crucial to not getting scammed. There are many videos on scams in Adopt Me. I've mentioned this before, but Faded Plays is a great resource. You can also search up types of scams in Adopt Me into Google, and there are long lists of in-depth explanations on the types of scams. Common scams include trust trading, which is a big no-no, selling your pets for cash, although some can be legit, it's just best not to risk it, someone offering Robux for your pet, which is a bad idea when offered to you in-game, but it can be done safely on Reddit with a middleman, also changing your pet's name, offering to raise your pet through trade, or trading someone the extra ads of a trade before the trade are also common scams. There are many more, so make sure you let me know down below if I missed any. But once you've learned every scam in the book, you can realise when someone is scamming you or help others to get out of situations if you spot them being scammed. Once you know the basics, it's pretty easy to not get scammed. Just so you know, if you got scammed, it's absolutely not your fault and it's absolutely the scammer's fault. Like putting your trust in someone and they purposefully letting you down or taking advantage of you, that's their fault. And a lot of scammers do it because they don't want to have to work for their pets, so... I hope that if you got scammed that you can work harder and try to get better than what you were scammed for and I, it's absolutely horrible I've been scammed before and yeah I really feel for the people that got scammed. This video was relatively short but if you enjoyed it let me know down below I'd love to hear your thoughts. If you have anything else to say I'll definitely reply to you and I also have a group so if you can't comment down below for any reason you can let me know in the group and I'll respond to you there. We are nearly at 4,000 watch hours which means I can get monetized which is like absolutely ridiculous I cannot even like I am so thankful for you all for watching my videos yeah thank you so much for the support I really appreciate it and you're all so nice I did get my first hate comment today which is pretty funny and this is the comment it was like saying about how um how pets aren't trash or whatever um I don't know I just thought it was funny once again you're all so amazing and I'll see you in the next one bye